We need some pool furniture. Maybe we don't need it, but we want some pool furniture. We have had the swimming pool now. This is the third summer and we have not had a good table out here. We just got this nice picnic table. We want to get some furniture. Pool furniture is very expensive. That's something people don't think about. I never thought about it. You've got the cost of the pool. I actually did a video a few years ago about how expensive it is to build a pool. But you don't think about things after the pool is put in. You gotta think about things like landscaping and furniture, grills and floats and on and on, a bunch of other stuff. So we have, oh, it's time to flip my steaks over. We're looking kind of rough. It's been a long day. It's the middle of June. It's very hot. I worked 12 hours today. It's a Saturday. It's his birthday. It is my birthday and I worked 12 hours today. As soon as our steaks are done, we're gonna ride down to Lowe's. I think that's where we're gonna get our pool furniture. We've been looking online. Rooms to go has a lot of nice stuff, but it's very expensive. <laughs> you okay? I'm good, how are you? It is the next day and we got our patio furniture. I keep calling it pool furniture, but I think it's called patio furniture. We got it out here on the patio. I'm gonna start putting this together. I think it is 95 degrees out here, 100% humidity. It's pretty miserable. At least I'm under the back porch, I'm in the shade. Uh, this one box was pretty beat up. And it's actually got, that's the bottom. I got it upside down. Had some cushions on the bottom. Doesn't seem too smart, but we opened it up a little bit at the store, checked everything out. It looks pretty good. I just got my air conditioner turned on. I got Miss B out here supervising. So I think we're actually ready to start putting this together now. The first thing you do as a man, you take any directions that you find and you just throw those away. <laughs> this is the style selections from Lowe's. I will say they did a great job packaging this. I like that there's foam on everything. So of course this came in a container from overseas, but it's packaged very well. So nothing is scratched up. We've got this box mostly unpacked now. Got my helper out here. We're gonna start putting these together. Now for the record, I'm not reading the instructions, but she does have them and she's reading them. So I think that's okay. been at this for an hour I think we finally got the first one done <laughs> we trust it. you don't trust my work I don't know. 
right. We sat in these in the store and they were very comfortable. They don't hold a lot of weight though. Second chair is done, finally. I think it took me like 30 minutes to put this thing together. I am using a ratchet and a wrench and also this little thing. I don't know what you call this. It's like an Allen wrench bit. The little Allen wrench they give you is a piece of junk. And also they give you this little tiny wrench. It would take forever to put this chair together with this. Wouldn't it be funny if I just drop this right now? It would not be funny. We did not realize this was a piece of tile. I mean, it looks nice, but how long is it going to last? One of our kids is probably going to put their feet up there and just break it. I think an hour later and the coffee table is done. So the last thing we gotta do is our little love seat. I'm in the middle of putting this love seat together. So I've been assembling all this furniture on cardboard because I'm trying to not scratch anything up. Somebody may have scratched up one of these chairs earlier. Yeah, this looks great. You can see the fine overseas craftsmanship. Now this had some plastic blocks on it to keep it from getting bent up or scratched up, I guess, but this is still, it's bent, like it's curved. So we're gonna try to straighten it out with some pliers. Well, that looks, let's do it one more time. I was worried about breaking this metal That's better. better. So I should be able to tighten it up more. I was worried about bending that piece back and breaking it because, you know, where this thing came from, they don't use the best quality metal. And usually, if you don't heat up metal before you bend it, sometimes you can break it. <laughs> One of your caps just fell off. four hours later and we're done you didn't velcro the things to the thing be all right. we finally got it done it's probably been four hours this is the elliott creek patio furniture from lowe's i think it looks good it's comfortable it was uh the price was okay so we still have a few things to do we need to get a couple tables over here and then i'm gonna put an outlet over here so we can plug in phones and whatever else. Yeah, we gotta get a rug, maybe put some more plants over here. I think we're gonna hang us up a fan up here. Special thanks to my helper here for this video. If you made it this far, thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.